Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm coming at you with my empties for the month of June. Not too many this month, but I figured I'd go ahead and show you guys what we finished up in my house. And um, just a little side note, I decided I'm gonna do my candles and wax melts in a separate video, probably about every two months. So look forward to that probably the end of July, beginning of August. So getting into what we finished, I used up a bar of Dove white soap. Love Dove, will always repurchase. Uh, my brother finished up one of these mahogany woods. He really likes that one. My husband finished up one of those Suave 2-in-1 products. It's in the Scent Ocean Charge. He really did like that one and we would repurchase. Next, I finished up one of these exfoliating body washes from Up and Up. It was in the scent of pomegranate seeds and coconut milk. It was really good. It was a gritty, um, a gritty scrub. I like to use these especially on my feet and just on my body. Usually like three times a week on my body and every day on my feet. So I would repurchase that. Next is Soft Soap Juicy Pomegranate and Mango Effusion. This one has such a nice scent. I definitely recommend that if you like fruity types of scents. And the consistency on the soft soaps are so good. So I definitely recommend you getting that if you're interested. Next, I finished up a Winter Candy Apple, one of my all-time favorite scents from Bath & Body Works. I got these end of the last summer annual sale in January. So I figured I'd use one in the summer and one in the winter, so I have one ready to go in the winter. Next, I finished up one of these Dial Soaps in the scent Cherry Blossom and Almond. I love these Dial Soaps. I got them from the Dollar Tree, and I just got a whole bunch from Walmart, if you saw our previous haul video. I do like these. This scent, though, I just wasn't crazy about it. Um, I prefer the Cherry Blossom scent from Bath & Body Works better, but it was okay. I would have purchased Dial Soaps, just probably not in this scent. Next, I finished up Bath & Body Works Into the Sky. I got this last summer at the SIS, so I didn't get a chance to use it last summer, so I used it this summer, and that one smelled amazing. Next is Moisturizing Hand Soap Aloe Vera from Up and Up. This I've been using in my kitchen. I've had this in my empties probably every month for the past few months. I got these for 70 cents a few months ago. So I definitely um, would repurchase those. They're nice and creamy. They smell good. And I feel like they don't make your hands like too greasy. They're soft afterwards. So I definitely recommend that. So those were my, you know, like personal, some of my, you know, soaps, body washes, things like that. So hang on and I'll show you guys some more of my empties. Okay, on to the next set of empties. I finished up one of these Garnier Fruities Fortifying Shampoos and Hydra Charge. Um, there's actually some mortar left. I have to clean it out. But that one, I like. I love Garnier Fruities. They smell good. They work good. And they have cute packaging, so I like the way they look in my shower. So that is definitely a repurchase. Next is Pantene. Um, this is in conditioner and moisture renewal. I love Pantene. I always have. I always will. We'll repurchase that. The VO5, um, I use the Herbal Escapes. This one, um, like I've mentioned in previous videos, I go through these much quicker. This probably was like three washes for me. So, whereas like the Pantene, I probably get, probably using it for like two weeks since I wash my hair every other day. I use a lot of conditioner. So that's why I usually go through like two or three conditioners in a month. But I would get the VO5 again. They smell good and they're cheap enough. I got these for 50 cents. In January I'm still going through them I still have probably maybe 15 or 20 more to go through I got like 40 or 50 to begin with so just using those up next is Colgate total um, I like this one my husband really didn't like it that much so I may not repurchase it just because he didn't like the scent but we'll see um, next is degree I finished up um, two of these I love degree they're my favorite scent uh, I hate at the end though, like when they pop off, there's a little bit left, but it's just so hard to use it. It gets really messy, so that's why I have to get rid of them when they're still like a little bit left. Like you can see, there's like the plastic thing. Um, but whatever, I love that scent. I have to use that because I'm very allergic to deodorants, so that will always be a repurchase. Uh, switched out my razor. We finished up two boxes of Kleenex. Um, these both are good. They both were with the lotion, so I like those. They were more like, you know, in like the end of winter when the cold season was still around. I wanted to make sure we had those. 
finished up a Max Fresh Colgate toothpaste. And sorry, there's a little piece of paper I put there, tissue paper, because there was some residue on there. And I finished up a package of cotton swabs. So um, these will be a repurchase, depending if I see them. If not, I'm not too picky with that kind of stuff. I just buy kind of like whatever. So those are my personal care empties. If you hold on, I will show you guys the cleaning empties. Okay, and last but not least, just some cleaning empties. Finished up an original Windex. I love Windex. Um, I got these for a dollar couponing. But I also like the Dollar Tree um, Glass Bus or Glass Cleaner, whatever it's called. That one works just as good as Windex. So I have that in my um, rotation right now. Finished up a Tide Simply Clean and Sensitive. I love Tide. I got these for 99 cents couponing with the coupon. So those are definitely... A repurchase. Finish up two of the toilet bowl cleaners. Don't know why I went through so many this month. I guess because we had a lot of guests come over. I cleaned more maybe. I usually clean. I give the toilet. I've mentioned this before. Like my cleaning videos. But I give my toilet bowl a daily wipe down. But I do a deep clean every Friday. So I usually change the thing out every Friday. But I think I've cha I changed it out a little bit more frequently. Because usually you get. Two, three, four. You get six, like, things, so that should last three weeks, one of them, for both toilets. You know what, maybe, I think this one might have been the last thing from last month. Maybe, I don't think I had one last month, that's probably what happened. But anyway, I, I used up a Lysol Wipes, this is the 80 count. I had gotten a six-pack off Amazon for free using my American Express rewards. I get those all the time, just from paying my bill in full and on time. I get like rewards points or whatever. So whenever I go on Amazon and I see how much I have, I'll usually just pick an item and I'll use my brother's Prime account. So I got six 80 count packages of this for free, which is awesome. So I finished up one of those. And then just two Dawn soaps, one in the Dawn Escapes and the regular cleaning one. These are great. I like Dawn. Even though their coupons don't really scan for me, I like um, like Ajax for that reason and Palmolive, their coupons always scan. But I do like the way Dawn cleans. But yeah, so those are my empties from this month. Nothing too crazy. And like I mentioned, uh, I'm going to do my wax and my candle empties in a different video going forward. Probably every other month I'll do that and show you guys like two months worth. And that way I can go a little bit more in depth with the candles and like the wax. Give you guys my real opinion. Things like that. I won't be as rushed as one of these. Just because there's a lot more stuff in my regular empties compared to my candles and my wax melts. So that's that. Hope you guys had a great weekend and I'll see you guys soon. Take care. Bye-bye.